What has already been done to repair the wooden boardwalk in Brighton Beach? What are the future plans for its improvement and maintenance? So, it's a big headache and a big problem and a big shame. Um, the part of the, if you paid attention to, to the uh, other part of the boardwalk where you, you, you see the concrete, this is, this is what has been done as a part of the renovation of the boardwalk. And by the way, it was done by my colleague and good friend, Alec Brukrasny, when he was in the New York State Assembly years ago. Uh, unfortunately, there's no agreement on how the boardwalk should be renovated because there are, uh, let's say, a lot of people in the um, uh, in, in the district that, that believe that it should be only done with natural wood. However, natural wood is the, the use of natural wood for, wood for the boardwalk is banned, is prohibited, uh, especially tropical wood. So we will need to replace it with plastic. It's like a mixture of wood and plastic, like artificial wood, I would say. And many people are against it. Uh, so first of all, we have to come to an agreement if we can use artificial plastic wood to repair the boardwalk. In my opinion, this is the only way to do it. If you've been to uh, Jersey Shore boardwalk, they did it and it, it looks beautiful, it looks amazing. So first of all, we have to come to an agreement, how do we repair? Second, we need to find money to repair. Uh, that, that's another, you know, that's a different, different problem, a different issue. But again, you're asking a question to me, I represent the state, and this is uh, basically a city issue, uh, because boardwalk, who's responsible for boardwalk is the New York City Department of Parks, and this is a city department, not, not state. So I can give you, like, more information about it that I, that I already, already gave, but first of all, we need to, should be willingness, we need to decide on if we are okay with replacing uh, natural wood with artificial wood.